Digital Romance TV. Hi, this is Michael Fiore from uh, DigitalRomance.tv, along with Nora Blake. And uh, today we're talking about four ways to approach a woman. From which, the front, mm -hmm. from the back. From the left. From the left and from the right. But not from those 45 degree angles. No, because those weird. are weird. No northwest, no anything like that. Don't do like that. that. Um, North, south, east, west. Yeah, so a lot of guys spend a lot of time no. uh, desperately trying to figure out pickup lines. And you know, the, the best pickup line, by the way, is hi. <laughs> like, if you do it right, it's actually a fantastic pickup line. The best pickup line is when she's high? Is that what you're Well, saying? that would do it as well, get her really stoned. No, but the <laughs> best way to approach a woman is with something to talk about, with a context, what? with a topic. You mean of like some kind. an actual conversation? Yeah, like, you know, and having some made something up, like... that's. Something that's going on that is actually interesting. Asking a question can be a bit can be a good way to do it. Um, you know, actually, I have a friend who uh, was saying that the best way for a girl, to, a woman, to approach a guy is to actually ask him for a favor, right? Saying, "Hey, can you help me with something?" Because guys always want to rescue women and all that kind of stuff. Um, but in general, like the best, in my experience anyway, the best way to meet uh, women. Can we back up just for one sec, just so you know, guys watching this? Anytime a girl is asking you for help, it doesn't always mean she's picking you up, though. Not always, Just no. so we're clear. No. But if she's, like, twirling her hair the entire time and her breasts are stuck out, then probably in some way. Either that or she likes to, or you know, just, touch her hair. Or and she's also just using she just her has big boobs. Wild. She's using her feminine wiles to, to manipulate you. To get point. you to help her. Uh, anyway, though, how do you approach women? Um, with a question, with a comment, with something that's going on. You know, my the most success I ever had with women back in the day when I was, you know, single and dating around all the time was always not at, like, a club or something like that, but at, like, you know, an activity of some kind, mm -hmm. at the gym, at yoga, at something else where you already have something to talk about, where you're not just very obviously walking up and saying, I think you have a beautiful ass and I would like to see what it looks like on my head. Like, just don't do that. It's really much just about living in your life every day and organically finding a way to talk to people and seeing if there's attraction. It's also important to understand that, like, the number one attitudinal shift that will help you not come across as the creepy guy who is just trying to pick up every girl at the freaking party is to not look at women and say, man, I would desperately love to bring her home tonight or something like that, but say, hey, I she's, would like to get to know her. She's pretty. I wonder if there's more than that. Yes. Right? Like, because that will come across mm -hmm. when you are approaching a woman. If you are qualifying a woman yourself, then it actually makes her see you as higher value. It makes her see, it makes her see you as somebody who is not just looking at her ass, and that's it. Yep. Yes, we are all initially attracted to physicality. Absolutely. It's a fact. But uh, if you approach a woman and, and have that attitude in your head, like, well, you're hot, but what else is there? And, you know, okay, right. that's step one has been covered. I find yep. you physically attractive, but what else is there? And so I know we didn't give you the exact four things to do, but really, it's much more about the attitude, and it's about being appreciative but not creepy. Yep. It's about being able to walk up to a woman and understand that she is beautiful but not thinking that because she is beautiful that she has all this power over you or anything like that. That's right. right. So there you go. If you have more comments, leave them down below and then go to digitalromance.tv for more. Bye. If you've got a cell phone in your pocket or purse right now, then you've got everything you need to create incredible romance and passion with the man or woman in your life at the push of a button. Go to digitalromance.tv forward slash TRB to see Michael Fiore make an entire audience of women on The Rachel Ray Show swoon and learn how to use tiny little text messages to have the relationship of your dreams.